Hi everybody, this video is to showcase data analytics using Exo. It's a project created for one of the airlines to maintain the load chart and seating plan uh, after flight. It's a graphical representation and the results are uh, derived uh, using few inputs. Uh, like uh, you can see that eight parameters are here. Uh, their maximum values and the actual values that you can change accordingly. So once we set it and then there is a value corresponding to the fuel uh, and there are a few more inputs uh, uh, like on the top uh, you can see uh, adjust operating mass index and then these fuel index correction and uh, depending on mass uh, there are a few uh, offset values accordingly we'll be using these and I'll be showcasing you uh, how these uh, functionality actually work on the right hand side you will see uh, weight per block and the shift direction so what does this mean is uh, uh, if, if my value is 1 then I need to move left if my value is uh, minus 1 then I need to move uh, right and uh, this will help us in plotting a graph and based on uh, that graph we will predict from the lower part of the graph uh, where you can see this section uh, uh, depending on the value that uh, comes out as the output we will comment that whether uh, this seating plan is safe uh, for travel or not so if I click on uh, generate depending on these values you can see that uh, this uh, uh, graph is uh, being plotted here and uh, you must be wondering that uh, we have not used any inbuilt uh, graphs that are provided by Microsoft Excel though we have uh, created our own uh, graph using VBA and uh, th this is nothing but uh, uh, we have used uh, only Excel cells and few other properties uh, uh, to, to, to plot this graph. The lines that you see uh, are nothing but the border colors um, which are treated as uh, the graph boundary. So based on uh, the intersection of this plot with uh, the lower portion of the, uh, of the graph, uh, we can comment that whether this journey uh, is safe or unsafe, whether the treating plan is okay or not. So, and and you must be saying that uh, in, at few points this graph is moving towards left and then it, it comes back to right. This is uh, dependent on the shift direction parameter. Uh, where you see plus one, it is moving towards left, and wherever you see minus one, it is moving towards right. And depending on the weight that we have given here in the actual value, it is moving uh, that much uh, much part uh, to the left. So we can reset always uh, and it will uh, take you back to the initial stage and uh, here uh, on the actual value let's say if it is 282 and weight per block is 200 that means uh, if I talk about first uh, section you can see there are a few uh, slanted li lines here and there are a few blocks on this, that, that section. So per block weight is 200 and I need to move uh, 282. So this is uh, how it is being evaluated. And if you want more details and if you want to see more about this video, uh, write to us at uh, Extreme Excel uh, Solutions uh, YouTube channel or you can also write an email to me at excel.microk at gmail.com. If you have any similar projects or any complex problem where you want to plot uh, something using graphs and there are not, uh, uh, that is not possible using uh, default Excel uh, graphs or charts, then uh, you can always contact me for that. Thank you for watching this video. Goodbye.